DIY loft installation. I haven't got a mask on yet because I'm not starting it. Because I'm talking to you. So, if you wanted to have your loft installated with a blanket insulation, which is the general type used, if you get a professional in, there are various different methods, but you would need a professional then. You've got uh, spray foam, you've got boards that are made of PIR, and also you can have it blown into areas, but you wouldn't be doing that unless you're very good. So I thought, you know what, I'll just show you down that end, that's over the lounge. And as you can see, it's just thrown all over the place. No wonder it's freezing down that end. Wondered why. This end, that's not too bad. It's actually been put down properly a, a bit. There's still a lot that's up, but I'm going to get to that. So, doing a DIY project. Reason for that is, I love to do DIY projects, but one of the main reasons is it can cost around £250 a day for a professional. God knows how many days I'd want. Maybe one, two, even three. So you're talking about between 500 and 750 pounds. I haven't got it. I don't want to do it. So I've had a look at it, read up on it, and you know what? It doesn't seem that hard. There's things that you need. First off, clear the loft of anything. As you can see, there's a couple of boxes in here and stuff that's been left from before. All that's got to come out. You want it all nice and tidy. Then you need a mask, gloves, them are the essentials. So the blanket one, which is the one we're using, which is here, yeah, that's a it's called a blanket bat material. It's made of sheep's wool or mineral wool. And also, just to let you know, it should be by our UK laws, your loft should be at least 270 mil thickness. What does it provide for you? Well, first off, it provides a lot of noise reduction from aeroplanes and such like. The most essential bit is it's going to reduce your energy bills by up to 25%, which is good news with the cost of uh, the energy bills at the moment. What else? Oh, reduces the carbon print, which is good news with all of what's going on, isn't it? So it's great. So I'm going to save... I reckon at least £500 by doing this myself. Never done it before, but you know what? It's always a first time, so I'm going to go for it. So I'm going to keep you informed. This is the loft in the house, and I'll be back to you soon. And thumbs up. Thanks for viewing. See you in the next one.